Hey there, it's Ruth Roland talking to you about hokum bowing. Hokum bowing is also known as cross shuffle or double shuffle. Many contests don't like you to use this bowing and they may even ban it outright. Hokum means balderdash or horse feathers, essentially just a lot of hot air. It's a very showy bowing. It's a true fiddle trick and it's much easier to play than it sounds like it should be. It does take a little bit of coordination though and I'm here to help with that. Hokum bowing is basically a pattern of three. Low, low, high. Laid on top of a pattern of four. One, two, three, four. And we keep repeating the pattern of three over the pulse pattern of four until we either even out or more likely have some left over. I'll show you how that goes. <laughs> Let's learn the short form of hokum bowing just on our highest two strings. So A and E if you're a fiddle, D and A if you're a cello or viola. You notice the high notes alternate pulling and pushing, down bow and up bow. Down, up. You probably noticed there were two extra low notes at the end that didn't get a high note. We have to repeat these extra notes every time because of the pulse pattern of four. Let's do four of the hokum pattern in a row. Bow, low, high, low, ready, and go. to do the extra low notes at the end and the first low notes at the beginning. It's easier when you have a tune when you're changing the low note. So let's do it on Boylan Cabbage. If you don't know it, I teach it in my video on shuffle bowing. So it starts with two fingers on the A string. And then we do half of the short pattern and half again and then finish it out. Or we can do speeding that up. One, two, ready, go. If you're having issues with the string crossing, I have a strings crossing video that you might find helpful. Hit the like button if you're enjoying this video and learning stuff. Let's do the long form of the hokum bowing. We count the high notes. One, two, three, four, five, and one, two, three, four, five, and a one, two, three, four, five. Let's do this together on an open string scale. Low, low, high, low, ready, and go. And back down the scale after this note. Now, Orange Blossom Special, that you heard a little bit of at the beginning, uses double string hokum bowing. Let's do this on our three lowest strings, sets of two, right? Then the middle string you always play. Sometimes for the push, I think of it as a scoop, especially on the upper strings. A scoop. Let's stick to the lower strings for right now. Low, low, high, low, ready, and go. A little faster. 
low, low, high, low, ready, and go. Great. Now let's try the highest three strings. One, two, ready, go. Wonderful. If you're new to double strings, check out this video next. I'll see you next time.